Hi friends, welcome to another video here at Jessica Myra's. Today we have a little Easter basket collab and we're going to be sharing some of the items that I am going to be prepping for my kiddos for this coming Easter and I hope that you get some ideas and inspirations. I will try to link some of these items as uh, if I have them available to share with you guys. So uh, if you like something you want to get for your little ones, you might be able to get them. Um, just check down in the description below for details and as well as the playlist because this is part of our second annual Easter basket collab and it is hosted by me here at Jessica Myros and my sweet and adorable friend Tiffany at Small Town 6. She is such a sweetheart. She is really kind, really sweet, great content, very talented. So be sure to check her out once you're done with my video so um, you get more ideas, more inspiration, subscribe to her channel, check out the playlist, subscribe to their channel, and enjoy today's collaboration. Let's go ahead and begin. All right, friends, so with Easter around the corner, I wanna try to give you some ideas of what you can get your kids. I feel like Easter has become a lot of like too many goodies, too many candies, and yet I will be adding those here, but I also wanted to get some items that they're useful for my kids. They're perhaps helping learning experience and entertainment or things like that. To begin, I'm gonna start with these uh, shirts. I'll open them up. I found them on Amazon, of course, my sweet friend Amazon here, and they are absolutely adorable. So I have two boys, and I thought that this was very fitting because, of course, they love dinosaurs, and just it's just so cute and perfect for this uh, Easter and time of the year. So they're both the same. Um, and I got two. This is a long time, a lifetime investment for my every year Easter. If you guys saw my previous year Easter basket collab, you probably saw at least might look familiar. They are from Pottery Barn. And they have a selection of different baskets that you can get and also get embroidered uh, to your kids' name. So I invested this for the first year of when I had my kids for their first Easter basket and from there on there will be their Easter baskets forever. Um, I think they are like a, you know, kind of like a lifetime type of basket. Um, they can send that over to their kids or they can display it as a different decor and you know, I just love how timeless and just great quality pottery and barn uh, products are and this basket especially I love because sometimes um, the baskets have like a firm arch like this and to put it in different places and try to fit it in different areas it might not fit uh, the this angle of the arch so this model is very unique and i just love uh the the way that i can just store it if i have to like store it in you know in a storage place and I, i'm not afraid that this will break off or something because it will just go down like that and there are all sorts of different baskets designs different um you know liners designs as well different fonts and different things that you can do for your very own baskets for your kids and I think they're just absolutely adorable and festive. So year in, year out, I just keep the filling in there for the basket. Um, you can get these at the dollar store anywhere really and I have these little carrots just to uh, add some accent for the um, decor on the um, on the little baskets and I have one basket for Josh from my son, my youngest son and Jay's. So one for each. They're both the same. They are not twins, you guys, but they are 18 months apart. 
and they pretty much wear the same size clothing and they want the same things every time so I just figure I will make it uniform like that they both love blue they both love yellow so this is the perfect design basket for them so if you are able to I highly recommend you checking them out Pottery Barn usually offers a sale during this time of the year for the Easter basket so be sure to check that out I'll try to see if I can I know that last year I think I had a hard time finding the same um, basket design um, but if I find it or if I find something similar I'll try to link it down below for you now moving on our a little paintable I think I have shared um, on one of my favorite videos um, the squishable um, painting your own squishy and they are available on Amazon um, they have a wide variety for, for girls boys um, like a um, big pack of different ones. I just got these different ones. One is a uh, taco with a fox, which my youngest love uh, foxes, and this dinosaur for my oldest. Um, it's just a great activity. They love the art after after it's all dry, and you know, a piece that they can keep as a little toy as well at the end. Now, we went to Kohl's and we found a few things that were gonna be perfect for these uh, spring, summer weather. Um, I found these ones. Uh, they were in, on sale and they were only $18, you guys. So that was definitely a steal. Um, unfortunately, I think they are on the bigger side um, because they didn't have the exact size that my kids use, but I will be here. They can still use them. They have straps all around and, um, you know, one, one for each, of course, and um, they can still use them perhaps maybe next year. We'll see depending on how much on the list. Um, I have found this, where did I find this? Oh, on, uh, on Walmart had a bunch of clearance stuff. Um, so I found these other little things that is a scribble, scrubby. Color and clean, adorable little dino pets. So you can, you can wash them, you can scribble, you can wash them, and then you can paint them again and again. It comes with, and they were on sale for two dollars. So it comes with a marker and a little toothbrush, so you can, you know, um, clean them up. And they're so, so different, so many different ones that you can do it. They're from the brand Crayola, and um, it will be great. Next, um, more arts and crafts because we love our arts and crafts in this house. Um, a traditional egg. And they're like um, the little porcelain or ceramic, what are they called? Um, uh, chalk? No, clay, clay, clay type of material. And they can just paint that, each of them. And last but not least, um, my youngest is obsessed with Spider-Man. And these were absolutely adorable. Um, now my oldest already have like a superhero one, but um, and it's actually his perfect size. So I don't have one for him, but I'm gonna have to figure something different because he doesn't really need one. Uh, so I'm gonna try to fit in some other like maybe clothing piece um, that he can have. But I just found this, and I think it was on parents too. I'm not sure. Probably not. I'm not sure. But yeah, it's um, it's so cute. I love the like undertone kind of um, faded red with the light blue. Uh, he is going going to absolutely love this. And that is it. And you guys, I have a cold cash. I forgot I had this. So oh, and it just went. That's sad. Doesn't that happen to you guys? Uh, it's the worst. But for now, that's what we have for our Easter baskets. Um, I am going to be including candy. There's all sorts of candy that you can find. My best place as a recommendation for you guys, if you have a five below uh, place, I think actually last year I got 
pretty much all of my Easter basket stuff from Five Below. That's a great place to find all the things that you want for your, for your kids Easter basket. So be sure to check that out um, if you have one nearby. Uh, it, it is a great, great place. But, but before now, that's it for my video. I hope that you guys enjoy and don't forget to check out the other ladies that are creating more inspiration for their Easter baskets. And I hope that you guys have an amazing day and happy Easter. It's a great time of the year and I hope that you guys enjoy it with your family and I will see you guys on my next one. If you are brand new here to my channel, I hope that you consider subscribing. I create content and I have tons of more content and ongoing collaborations um, for you all from lifestyle, motherhood, homemaking, um, wellness, cooking videos, unboxing, and everything that I create is with a lot of love and passion. I love creating these videos for you guys and I hope that you guys absolutely enjoy them um, while I create them for you. And I will see you guys on my next one.